FDA sets date for decision on twice yearly shots to prevent HIV. Key takeaways Lenacapavir is delivered in subcutaneous injections given every six months. In two phase three trials, it was shown to reduce the risk for HIV infection by 96% to 100%. The FDA has accepted Gilead Science's new drug application for lenacapavir as a long-lasting injectable to prevent HIV infection and set a date of June 19 to decide on its approval, Gilead announced Tuesday, delivered in two subcutaneous injections. Every six months, Lena Capavir received breakthrough therapy designation from the FDA in October after it was shown to reduce the risk for HIV infection by 100% in a phase 3 trial of cisgender adolescent girls and young women in Africa. And by 96% in a phase 3 trial of gender diverse participants in seven countries, including the United States. It also demonstrated superiority over Gilead's daily oral prep medication, entricitabine slash over disaproxyl fumarate. The capsid inhibitor is already approved in the U.S. for the treatment of resistant HIV infections. If approved for HIV prevention, it would become the second long-acting injectable prep option on the market after 7V Healthcare's Cabotagraver, which is administered every two months. Experts have described twice-yearly lenacapavir as a potential breakthrough in HIV prevention. Below is a timeline of some of our coverage. Twice-yearly shot prevents HIV in Phase 3 trial. Gilead reports, in June, Gilead announced top-line results from an interim analysis of the Purpose 1 trial, which showed that lenacapavir prevented HIV acquisition among cisgender adolescent girls and young women at 28 trial sites in South Africa and Uganda. Full results confirm potential breakthrough in HIV prevention. In July, full results of Purpose 1 were published in the New England Journal of Medicine and presented at a major scientific meeting, the International AIDS Conference in Munich. In a perspective, Hialeo, Infectious Disease News Chief Medical Editor Paul A. Valberding, MD, called the results, a dramatic game-changer in the crucial issue of HIV prevention. Twice-yearly injections prevent HIV in another Phase 3 trial, results from the Purpose 2 trial were shared by Gilead in September, showing that lenacapavir reduced HIV infections by 96% compared with background HIV incidents among cisgender men, transgender men, transgender women, and gender non-binary people who have sex with men. And demonstrated superiority over daily oral prep, lenacapavir poised to transform HIV prevention. Positive findings from the lenacapavir trials continued to roll in at the HIV Research for Prevention Conference in Lima, Peru. Lenacapavir for PrEP has the potential to transform, together with other agents, the global HIV prevention landscape for people of all genders. Does the world still need an HIV vaccine? Experts say yes, the advent of long-acting PrEP has energized the field of HIV prevention research but also muddied the future of HIV vaccine research. For instance, how can a trial evaluate HIV vaccine efficacy if participants are also offered injections of lenacapavir for ethical reasons? We asked experts if the world still needs an HIV vaccine given the success of long-acting injectables. And they all had the same answer. This story also includes details on the potential cost of lenacapavir prep.